The Alaska Range, with 20,000-foot Mount McKinley, forms a great crescent across south-central Alaska. Here, Gary seeks doll sheep, the beautiful white sheep of Alaska and the Yukon. You could say he's come a long way from the South Dakota farm where he was brought up and the taxidermy shop in Sioux Falls where he apprenticed, but his heart hasn't budged an inch. What was built into his soul then remains. When he steps into a wilderness, it's still like coming home. He becomes part of it, a brother animal going about his own business. This old ram is a veteran of a lot of rutting seasons. He died during the following winter. This group has decided not to pose. Getting close to a doll sheep is one of nature's more difficult tasks. They live on the top of the world, feeding mostly on lichen and alpine mosses. Their chief natural predator is the wolf, but ram groups will generally keep a sentry on duty and escape terrain nearby. Gary can make out a ram in that gray cloud which covers the mountaintop. And another. and ewes spend a great deal of the year in separate groups. Close to each other, perhaps, but separate. The doll sheep is one of the few animals that remain white the year round. Many experts believe these sheep migrated here on the geologic land bridge from Asia. Gary moves carefully around the rock to get even closer to these beautiful but wary animals. This trip is nearing an end. All the sketches, notes, snapshots, and sample rocks or bits of horn will go into a manila envelope to bring home. Gary's file cabinet bulges with manila envelopes. I only hope I live long enough to paint all those pictures. Amen to that, Gary Swanson.